welcome to today's webinar, Protocol Deviations, Documenting, Managing, and Reporting. My name is Marla Helley. I will be your trainer today. I have several handouts that you received with your email, and we will reference these handouts during today's session. But it's also important if you take a look at these documents following the session as well, because they can be helpful in enhancing the training that we have gone over today. Our learning objectives for today are to describe the key components of protocol deviation documentation and how we report protocol deviations. Also, looking at the individual stakeholder roles in the management of protocol deviation. So who is responsible in the capturing and reporting of protocol deviations? And we're going to learn today that that really is a shared responsibility and also to describe a process to proactively identify, track, and evaluate deviations for a greater effectiveness in study management. And this brings us to really what happens in clinical trials. We know protocol deviations are going to occur. It's a fact of life. Now, what we want to make sure of is that this does not become a pattern for practice behavior, that we really need to focus on those efforts that matter the most. That's part of what we need to do as the sponsor or if we're a CRO to ensure that we help train, educate our investigative sites so they are aware of important data collection points and also aware of how to prevent protocol deviations. And one thing that sometimes can cause a challenge for investigative sites are performing procedures that are not part of standard of care. And this is because the site is not used to doing these tasks, and therefore they may forget to perform this task. And this is really where we need to explore with the site to find out how are you going to implement the study-related procedures to prevent this from causing a protocol deviation. So here are two definitions, both the ICH definition and the FDA definition of protocol deviations. So ICH says that a deviation is any change, divergence, or departure from the study design or procedures defined in the protocol. And FDA says a protocol deviation or violation is generally an unplanned excursion from the protocol that is not implemented or intended as a systematic change. So the way I look at it as far as a definition of protocol deviation is very sim simple. You did not do what you were supposed to do. And by not doing what the protocol asked you to do, this is where we have a concern and we're concerned about the safety and welfare of our subject and also about the data integrity. So let's just take a moment here. Do you think that the term deviation, violation, variance, noncompliance, change in clinical research, do you think that these are analogous to one another. What do you think? Yes or no? So do you think that these mean the same thing? I see that we have a check mark here from Sid. What do you think, Gladys and your team? Do you think that the deviation is analogous with a violation, variance, noncompliance, or a change in research? Yes or no? Yes, very good. I agree. We can see definitions actually in the regulations that are defining a deviation. 
both in ICH and in FDA Code of Federal Regulations. Now, in the definition from FDA, we don't even see violation referenced until we look at the FDA CPGM BIMO. So this is a document that's used by FDA investigators when they are going to perform an inspection at an investigational site. We as sponsors typically will look at the deviation that has occurred and we may categorize the deviation as being a violation if it impacts or affects the safety of the subject, such as a subject that enrolled in the clinical trial that was ineligible, or perhaps did not report, say, a serious adverse event. So we can categorize this saying, okay, we think that this is greater, we're calling this a violation. But regulatory authorities say, it doesn't matter you still didn't do what you were supposed to do. So even though you may categorize it differently, it still is a deviation no matter what. 